Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be going over this look right here, a smoky eye with a metallic liner. If this is something you would like to learn how to do, just keep watching. Starting off with my eyes, I'm using my Revlon Color Stay Concealer as an eyeshadow base to conceal any darkness and veins, and I'm just blending that in with my fingers so that we have a nice even base for our eyeshadows. As always, I'm using Mylar from MAC and I'm using that as my brow bone highlight. I'm setting the shadow down and then blending the excess onto my lid to set that concealer. For my transition shade, I took Malt, also by MAC, and on a fluffy crease brush, applied that through the crease and out of the area using circular motions and windshield wiper motions. Then I took my Urban Decay Naked Smoky Eyeshadow Palette and on the same brush, I took the shadow called Password and blended it through the crease area to start to give the eye a bit more definition. And just using the same when she did wiper motions, I went back and forth, back and forth, and built up that color. Then I took my L'Oreal Mono Eyeshadow called Macadam Princess, and on my Mac 217, did the exact same thing. I deposited the color on the outer V area and blended the excess through the crease and whatever was left on my brush lightly dusted it over my eyelid. Then I took Dagger from the Urban Decay Naked Smoky Eyeshadow Palette and applied this to the outer V and crease area. Again, it's a lot of crease work, outer V work, you'll get the picture. Just put it on the outside of your eye, you'll be grand. And I tried to make it elongate my eyes, just creating a V shape. Then to add a, a bit more definition, I took Black Market on a fluffy blending brush from Kiko and did the exact same thing, applied it to the outer corner, outer V area and blended it out. Then I cleaned up my under eye area using a makeup wipe. Then taking the Maybelline Last and Glossy Liquid Eyeliner, I did my eyeliner with this. I got this for a pound in Pineland and I think they get like makeup brands cast off because there's something wrong with the packaging. Like there's no name on this, like it doesn't have a name or the colour, so that's what I got for a point. Check out, you know, they're fantastic. Then I lined my tight line using my Rimmel Soft Cool Eyeliner Pencil. I curled my eyelashes and then applied my mascara using my L'Oreal Lash Sculpt Mascara. I have a bit of a love-hate relationship with this mascara. I love the wand and the way it looks but it clumps my lashes together something fierce and I tend to use a cotton bud. So I did my face off of camera and yep, um, you guessed it, I'm going in with my Makeup Geek Contour Powder in Breakup and I'm using this to contour. I'm using my 17 blush brush for this as always and as always I can never say blush brush. So I took that to the hollows of my cheekbones, my temples, my jawline, my hairline, usual places. Then I went in with Love Triangle from Makeup Geek as well. You've seen me use, do this several times by now and use this as my bronzer using my Real Techniques blush brush. For my blush, I took Rose Gold from Sleek and applied that to my cheeks using my Look Good Feel Better blush brush. As always, I love this blush brush. I don't use anything else for my blush. It's always this one. So going back to the under eyes, I took Macadam Princess again from L'Oreal and on a small eyeshadow brushes from Royal. 
I applied that to my lower lash line going from outer corner to inner corner and blending it out. Then I went back in with Black Market from the Urban Decay Naked Smoky Palette and applied this to about the outer half of my eye, I think. And then for my inner corner highlight, I took Mylar from MAC. Then I lined my waterline using the same eyeliner from Rimmel. And then for my lip colour, I went in with a sleek lipstick in the colour Barely There. And then I took a cotton bud and just blended it out so that it wasn't so pigmented looking. And I wanted it to be a little bit more colourless, well, new. So I took the Maybelline Color Sensational Lipstick in 710 Sultry Sand and I was actually startled by how nude it looked. I was like, oh yeah, that's nude. Yes, nude. And again, I went in with the cotton bud just to blend the two colors together. And that's it. That's you done for this smoky eye with a metallic winged eyeliner. Hope you guys liked it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.